Colin Barnett is demanding answers from his Transport Minister after private polling opened up leadership tensions and deep divisions within the government. The Premier has branded the polling by high-profile business figures and Liberal Party donors as an act of disloyalty. I cannot be bought, I cannot be unduly threatened or influenced. To Colin Barnett and his backers, this felt a lot like WA Inc. Private polling funded by business, led by an investment banker, showing the Premier was steering the Liberal Party to a massive election loss. To do a poll and then seemingly use that to try and topple a Premier of Western Australia uh, is, is not proper conduct. I think it shows a disloyalty and I think it shows a disloyalty to me as the Premier of Western Australia. The polling has been in the hands of Dean Norder for days. I was shocked with the results. It's not something that I discussed publicly. I have shared it with a, uh, with a couple of my colleagues. But not the Premier, who's now demanding answers. I think Dean and I do need to sit down and have a good chat. Prominent businessman John Poynton co-commissioned the poll and showed it to those 10 or so backbenchers who face losing their seat. Get a shock, have a look. The public's really concerned. They're quite angry in some cases. Take note of that and do what you will. The policies and the platforms and the beliefs and the leadership of the Liberal Party is not for sale and can't be influenced. This looks to me like business getting far too involved in the affairs of government. It is going to harm uh, their preferred candidate. Uh, it will not have the effect that they wanted and it should not be tolerated. That preferred candidate is Dean Norder, who one MP says has no chance of becoming leader. That's right, no chance in order because I'm saying I'm, that's the message I'm sending to John Poynton and to Nigel Satterley. I'll only ever contemplate my position um, should the Premier choose to step aside, and I believe that's his decision. When the Premier will now ask the Public Sector Commissioner to investigate. I was not involved in any yeah, commissioning not of the, the question, poll. But, were you yeah, but I'm giving you the same line every time. It, I'm not, not, I'm not involved. I have not been involved in the commission, commissioning of this poll. And Josh Yoga is at Parliament House tonight. So, Josh, where to now? Is Colin Barnett safe? Emmy, well, his position has certainly been solidified. Some of Colin Barnett's detractors have conceded to Nine News. This has all but killed off the prospects of a leadership challenge. And the Premier's fate is now in his own hands. The same cannot be said for Dean Norder. Some senior Liberal ministers are urging Colin Barnett to sack his transport minister, one of his cabinet colleagues, has described his behaviour as treacherous. In the past 24 hours, some of those ministers have told the Premier they no longer want to work with Dean Norder. They want him stripped of his ministerial responsibilities.